How to display my data onto a jog map using Mapbox JLJS. Thank you for tuning in to this tutorial. In this one, I will show you how you can display data you're hosting outside the jog lab to create a simple store locator like this. To get started, let's head into the documentation to find the sample code. In the SDKs and software section, under Mapbox JLJS, open up the Add Your Data page. As you can see here, we have a simple store locator example with some sample code. Let's use this to integrate our map into our website. Let's open the page's source code and break it down. Here, we have the map script. In this example, we're using a vector map, so we've copied these lines that we'll call the Mapbox JLJS library into our head tag. Now, let's look at the script that will integrate our jog map. I've copied this part of the script and added it here. I've also replaced the access token information. You can find yours here. And picked a style for the map, Jog Sunny. Here, we can also indicate the level of zoom we'd like and the precise location for the landing view of our map. Now for the main event. We have a GeoJSON file listing all the data points, i.e. our stores, that we want to show on our map. To do so, we store the file into a database so we can fetch our data from our API. So this is where you will enter your own endpoint. And that's pretty much it. Easy peasy. All right, let's save and open this page up in our browser to check out our store locator. What a beauty. Thanks for watching and see you in the next jog tutorial. Thank you.